Welcome back, everybody. We're here for Two Minute Tuesday. We're going to try to keep it to two minutes, but it might be 22 minutes. Um, today, we're going to talk about and talk with, we've got Judy and Emily here from Morgan Franklin Fellowship. Um, we just finished up a, a meeting in this new world that we're in, and we decided that today would be a good, uh, a good discussion to have how we're staying sane with um, being stuck at home more and what we're doing to, to kind of make it work. A um, couple things that we've done, and uh, actually I'll start with me. So a couple things that I've done is I still get up in the morning and put on work clothes. Um, I still work out at a regular time each day, uh, typically around lunchtime to break things up, whether it's a run or a bike ride. And the other way that I kind of keep my day going is I check in right away um, at eight o'clock on Slack to kind of get the day going. And then I communicate throughout the day. So it still feels like a work day. Now, how are you uh, surviving, Judy? Um, well, I worked from home for about 20 years. And uh, just over the past three and a half, four years, I started working outside the home again. Um, so I think I'm slipping right back real comfortably into working from home, which might be scary because then I'll have to get used to going to work again. Um, I, I do, like you, I, I get up in the morning. I have a regular routine. I try to go to bed um, and get up at the same times every day. Um, but I tend to get up and, and crush work for three or four hours. Um, I, I tend to get up earlier than most people, so it's kind of quiet. But I, I tend to want to do those things that I can't get done right, uh, throughout the day because they're so busy. Um, first thing in the morning, then I take a shower, eat, um, and then come into my office um, and sit at my big, at my big computer. Um, and that seems to keep me going. Um, although, like you, I really um, need to get out more. You know, I think that's a really good point that I'd like to incorporate into my day. <laughs> Emily, how are you doing? <laughs> Well, um, I don't know if I would say that I am as scheduled as I usually am, but I am trying. I definitely have been getting dressed every day, although I will admit that includes sweatpants every day because that's just really comfortable. <laughs> but at least I, I have regular clothes on. Um, and I always start my day with a cup of coffee and then have one in the afternoon. That has increased, but it's still something that I'm keeping up with. Um, I'm definitely trying to get out for exercise. That's a, that's a big thing, especially with staying at home. It's, I, I definitely really need to be outside. That, that helps me a lot. Uh, and I've been pretending that my room, because I have a desk in my room, so I've been pretending that that's my office. So I, I get up in the morning, make my coffee, take a few minutes to myself, and then I come in my room and, and kind of make that my space. So I think that that helps to have a, a working area that helps me feel like I'm at work. So I'm uh, doing what I can. <laughs> awesome. Well, thank you for joining us today, everybody. So again, you've got Emily, who's our director of students, Judy, who's our executive director, and I'm the director of operations at the Morgan Franklin Fellowship. We focus on online learning with a big focus on financial literacy. So if you're looking for something to do with your students, by all means reach out, or if you have questions about how we're battling the uh, work from home and making it work for us, by all means reach out. Until next time, uh, we'll look forward to seeing you at our next Two Minute Tuesday.